Oh, sorry. Are you having a wee? I won't watch. I won't watch. I'll put your breakfast down here, okay? Good morning, little man. And morning tea. <laughs> and some breakfast, sweetheart. And some breakfast. He's handsome. He's coming up for a kiss. Oh, he's handsome boy. He's not bad either. Yeah. Good boy. Enjoy your breakfast, sweetheart. Good morning, sweetheart. Got out from under your little sleeping bag. I can see somebody else moving. Who's that? <laughs> Who's that? Hey, good morning. Oh, wee wee. Hello, my darling. How excited are you? Oh, wee wee's. Come on, then. <laughs> Get him, Minky. Get him. Oh, Dave. Dave's involved. He's involved. Go for a wee wee then. Daddy, take you. Wee! -wee.
was staying upstairs. What are you doing? Just sorting out the cupboard. Cause there's all sorts. Ah. Thanks. And plus, because you're tiny and I'm massive, I'm moving things around so I can find things and you can find things that you use. So, And all your alcohol stash is now down there. I don't drink. That's for the guests. I know. I've had to throw a couple away because they're out of date. Ah, oh, thank you so much. Bye-bye. Well, that's the hair and a little bit of makeup done. And then I think I might do some crafting this afternoon. We will see. I hope you enjoyed that little makeup tutorial and my hair tutorial. Really doesn't take me that long. 15, 20 minutes. Really easy. Can I go walkies, Dave? Can I go walkies? Come on, then. Dave, come on. Come on. Your coat on. Stay there. Okay. Okay. Maybe. Where are you going? Oh, yeah. Can you get your things on? Wait, wait, wait. Let me take your coat on. It's cold. Stay there. Good boy. Stand up. Stand up, good boy. Ready? So I've got my more oversized jumper on and my J Flex leggings which I love we're all ready to go out for a dog walk and I just had a text saying that my new Hoover delivery is going to be delivered between now and half eleven why does that always happen when you're just about to head out the door so I'm going to put that on there we go thank you Come on. So the top shelf is lids for Tupperware that has no containers. We have <laughs> millions of lids. I'm not sure why, but we have the middles actually fit. So give that a couple of weeks and then we'll lose all the tubs for those. The rest of it's all just stuff I've stashed. We've got rid of all the, all the extra tea bags for the, the um, Dolce Gusto and all that. All your spices, all your stock pots, all your oils and weird like witch's potion stuff and all that. Then we've got my 17 million boxes of parboiled rice. Rice, all your fish sauce, oyster sauce, soy sauce, noodles, ramen noodles, gravy, pastas, three tubs of tomato puree for some reason. <laughs> Thank you for that. Isn't it great when your hubby sorts all the cupboards out for you? I've got rid of all the glasses that we don't use because you don't drink and I don't use glasses because I drink out of cans like a 
proper nail on the foot. So I've moved all those, all your cups at the bottom, all your cauldrons and stuff because you're like a weirdo. Um, I've left the glasses up, the cactus glasses up the top for you for when the girls come round because I know you like weird, drinking weird concoctions out of those. Cocktail cactuses? Yeah. And then obviously just the plates and bowls and stuff like that. All the smaller cups are in there for me. I've put them on that shelf because I know that you can't reach because you're only two foot three. Although that's my mug. Yes, so some of them are your cups, <laughs> but I've just put them in there. And yeah, decaf coffee. Don't see the point myself, but I've left it in there for you. Thank you, Baba. And there you've got all your tin stuff. Your six tins of chickpeas at the back. So if you ever do feel like a chickpea, there's plenty. <coughs> All the bolognese stuff and your spices, all your sauces. On the bottom shelf is all your cereals and random little onions. Thank you. We need to get this new kitchen, don't we? Yeah, we need to really sort it out. And then all your glasses that we never use and the... All the booze that we never drink. Mm. Oh, I got all excited that that was the Hoover, but it's the Garden Pro sprayers that we ordered. Oh, never mind. What I thought I might do is I bought this beautiful box off Amazon and I thought I might paint it for a memory box. So I got some little tester pots of Farrell and Ball. This one which is Calamine 230 and this one which is called mizzle like a real pale sage green so i thought i'd give it a go and see if i can paint it i'm not sure if it'll work if this actually works on wood or i need to do anything to the wooden box first but i'm going to give it a go i'm going to go in with the calamine first camera like a sage green really pale and a really pale pink just turn it around so I might give it another coat or I might just um 
Cricut uh, vinyl letterings on it. I don't know yet. Happy with that. I'm just going to have a tuna sandwich. watch a film and please remember get your smear checks blokes get your prostate checks don't let doctors fob you off don't let people in the scans diagnose you when they're just guessing what it might be if you feel you need more clarification you push for more this is what this channel's about not just me vlogging my day it's about empowering you to know your own bodies and get answers and not be fobbed off. Susie's at home, she's booked a lodge uh, at the end of April for a sleepover with as many people that want to come really, popping in and out over three days. So please all pray that that can go ahead and this video is getting really long so I thought I'd split it and I will see you all in the next one.